In fact, let me pull up on my screen over here. I'm going to pull up the investor. The, this is the CME Group's kind of Fed probability rate. It kind of shows us what the uh, investors have priced into the market. And so if I look at July, uh, which probably has the most confidence right now because it's only a couple weeks away, you know, nobody's expecting any policy changes for July. But look at what happened in September. So, you know, there's been kind of a majority of investors that thought that the first rate drop might be in September. Well, look at the difference. So a week ago, this number was 72%. Now it's 88%, right? So it's almost a given, uh, or at least the market has priced in that there's going to be a quarter point rate drop. Even a month ago, this was just around 60%. And now it's at 88, almost 90%, right? Confidence that there's going to be a rate drop. And then what's interesting to me is, you know, we always thought that maybe there'd be a second rate drop in December. All of a sudden, there's a lot of folks who think a second rate drop might come as early as November, right? This number just... Um, just a week ago, this number was at 33%. Now it's at 53%, right? So now all of a sudden, maybe there's going to be, uh, you know, there's a, there's the, the market is starting to price in a second rate drop as early as November. And then even the December number. So now it's instead of just, you know, one or two rate drops, maybe it's going to be two or three rate drops. At least that's what's being priced in.